The Torrey Pines Falcons defense has been dominating all season long, but could they keep it going? Olivia Person went out to Del Mar as the Falcons hosted the Mount Carmel Sun Devils. Olivia? Here the homecoming game for Torrey Pines is taking on Mount Carmel. Now neither team is ranked top 10, but it's been predicted that the Torrey Pine Falcons will be dominating this game. Will the Falcons soar over the Sun Devils and get that big W, or will the underdogs take over? Let's fly into the action. Just minutes into the first quarter, Paul Jaxco intercepts the ball, and just another minute later, Mark Deepro is where he needs to be, and touchdown, Falcons. The extra point is good, and Falcons 7, Sun Devils 0. Sun Devils with the ball now, Riley Caniglo comes out of the crowd and gains 46 yards until he's taken down by Colin Brown. Moving into the second quarter, the Falcons are wasting no time. Chase Pickle gets the touchdown, gaining that extra point, and it's 14-0 Falcons. The Falcons are back at it, and just like that, number 35 Chase Pickwell again breaks a tackle and just casually walks into the end zone. They go for the extra kick, and it's good, ending the first half 21-0 Falcons. Moving into the second half now, the Falcons are in the house and aren't budging. Jack Bailey with another touchdown for the Falcons. Falcons go for that extra point, and it's 28-0 Falcons. Colin Brown is at the right place at the right time and intercepts the ball. Tough break, Sun Devils. After a bad snap to Mount Carmel, Scott Patter is forced to kick the ball out of the back of the end zone, giving the Falcons two more points. Fourth quarter, the Falcons are still at it, ending the game strong with 44-0. I'm here with Scott Ashby, the head coach of the Falcons, and um, I just wanted to ask you really quick, how did you go from losing against Vista last week 2-0 to zero, to this amazing dominating win? Well, you know, I got to be honest, Vista's a heck of a football team. They're really coming on. They have a lot of young kids, and it was a great defensive battle. Anytime that Torrey Pines and Vista play, it's going to be a defensive game. Um, I thought Mount Carmel was incredibly talented, but I thought our defense just played lights out. And uh, our offense quit making mistakes and did a lot of great things, ran the ball hard, blocked hard, just a great team effort. What an amazing win the Falcons had against the Sun Devils. Now next week, they're going to be taking on Poway, which is 2-2. Two and two. We'll see if they get that big W next week. I'm Olivia Person, sending it back to you guys at the Yelly. studio. Yelly. Thanks, Olivia. The Falcon defense keeps rolling along and have not given up a single offensive point for 13 straight quarters. If the Falcons offense can find some consistency, they can make a strong push into the playoffs.